guys, Vapor Rhino over here. Thank you for coming back. And uh, this is going to be another e juice review, and we're going to e uh, review Candy King Swedish. Okay, so this is obviously the Swedish fish flavor. All right, we're going to rock it on the UL uh, crown tank. This is the SE1 at 45 watts, it's a 0.50 ohms, and we're going to do it on the 1920H uh, Cthulhu. All right, and we're going to rock that at 24 watts at point, point 0.40 ohms, okay? So, packaging. Really simple. Nothing crazy. Nice and colorful. Really clean. It's got that glossy finish. You know, it tells you it's, uh, it says Candy King Swedish. It's a 100 milliliter, 100 milliliter bottle. Uh, uh, this is also a zero milligram. Okay, I believe so, but it doesn't say. Let me see what. No, it, wow, yeah, okay, boom, right there, real big. Anyway, warning label. So the packaging, I'd have to give it like it's really super clean, nice and nice little box. I give it like a, a nine out of ten. All right, warning label. This is what I'm talking about. This, look at that, bam, the whole fucking side in it, and here it is. Gives you phone numbers. Gives you. Uh, the, the proposition 65 ingredients okay tells you if uh, keep it away from children pets uh, allergen warning I mean 10 out of 10 right there this is what all labeling should be like right there right there perfect labeling you know company right there you know and, and I like that they also provide you a phone number really really nice really nice okay pulling the bottle out Bam, same, replicated, right on the bottle. See, this is what I'm talking about. This, I am very happy with this. Perfect label number right there. See, this is like, this is people telling you we're not afraid. This is who we are, okay? All right. So, this is a 100 ml bottle, like I said. So, I have it in my tank. Let's take a quick toot out of this one. Let's see how it comes out of this tank. Vapor production, 8 out of 10. So, it's not an overly sweet juice. Even though it's a candy, it's not overly sweet. But I got to tell you guys, I'm really spoiled because of the Gone Fishing from uh, Seven Star Juices. Fucking Donnie Ray's Gone Fishing. This is his version of the Swedish fish. He's got it right on point. So, and, and this is a bad comparison because I'm... I'm thinking of that. That was the first uh, Swedish Fish e-juice I've ever tasted in my life. And I just fell in love with it. And it actually really is good. Now, this is good. I'm not knocking it at all. But I just keep thinking of that flavor while I'm vaping this. And I shouldn't be doing that. But it is very good. I can definitely taste the Swedish Fish. It's not overly sweet. Very good. Very good. Let's try it now in this little flavor banger over here. This is my uh, 1928 from Cthulhu. Juice up those coils. All right. Yeah, I did it again. Okay. I'm going to pick it up to about 20, 26 watts. I'm not getting really a much difference between the tank and this uh, little RDA. So, anyway, so conclusion. Uh, I, 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 this is a good juice. But again, I am giving you a false reading because I'm thinking of that gone fishing. And um, I'm not saying that I would not buy this again because I love everything this company is doing with their bottles. So what I will do though is I probably wouldn't buy the Swedish Fish again because I've already found one that I like. But I will check out their other flavors 
because it's, this is how I would like to support a company that does all of this. Packaging, labeling, warning. I mean, excellent, excellent job. Candy King, I don't know who is this. Who, let's see who says this is made by. Let's see. I guess it's got to be dripmore.com. So, Candy King by dripmore.com. So, but uh, anyway, excellent packaging, excellent uh, warning label. Uh, they definitely got my attention, and uh, I will definitely check out more of their flavors. Uh, as far as the Swedish fish goes, it is very good. Uh, I wouldn't hesitate to try it. I did catch it at a, a really good price. It was like a $4.95, I and mean, you really can't go wrong for $5 uh, at 100 mLs. So I would definitely suggest, uh, you know, if you guys want to check it out, you know, look it up. Uh, you know, Google is your friend, as they say. And um, uh, uh, definitely check it out. But I am going to check out their other flavors and see what else they got. Uh, I will, I'm pretty interested to say, to see the other flavors, if, if they're as consistent as good. This was good, like I said, but it, it's just not better than Gone Fishing. And I would have to stick with Gone Fishing uh, just because I enjoy it. Anyway, this concludes this video. Guys, thank you for watching. Vape and Reiner, consider subscribing to my channel. Hit that like button. Catch you on my next review.